Brain Gain is sponsored by Farmers National Bank, Sweeney Chevrolet Buick GMC, the Mahoning Valley Manufacturers Coalition, and Southwoods Health. The first part of their senior year, my students go through the STNA program, which is the State Tested Nursing Assistant program, and earn that certification where they can go work at long-term care facilities or hospitals or doing home care to take care of their patients. It is a in-demand job right now, especially due to COVID. A lot of folks are trying to keep their loved ones at home instead of taking them to uh, facilities. So home care is a really booming industry for them right now. I have multiple people that email me or call me, ask me if they, I have anybody that is willing or able to help to take care of their loved ones at home or at a healthcare facility. The hospitals are not as willing to allow high school students to work there, but I have had students, once they have graduated, that they have acquired um, uh, jobs at the hospitals in the hospital setting. I have many students when they continue their education in nursing school that they are working as aides um, to help them get through school. It gives them a lot of experience, gives them hands-on experience, communication, teamwork, and uh, it gives them a lot of experience in working with other people and working with the patients before they graduate as a nurse. I feel like this is the first time in my life I've ever actually had to study. It's a lot to go into. However, the way that she prepares us, Ms. Meyer, it's hands-on, we do a lot of work, and when you put in that work, you can definitely see the reward with her different teaching styles and memorization skills here. I didn't originally want to come into this course. I wanted to go to public safety, but then I realized like, I really like the medical field and I really like being part of like something to make a better change. So that's why I decided to come here. The hands-on stuff is definitely my favorite part. I mean, it helps you learn and it helps you experience it so that when you get out into the real world, you're not, oh, I read this in a book, but I don't exactly know how to do it. So you actually get the experience. I have been um, accepted into Kent State Trumbull for their nursing program, so I will be going there. And then I want to further my education and see where it leads me. Not everybody can do this type of a job. You have to have the, the drive and the desire and the love to be able to want to take care of people. And not all people can do that. So um, it really makes them unique individuals and in their abilities of what they can do. In early childhood education here at TCTC, uh, what we're standing in right now, it is a state licensed preschool. So what we do every day in this lab experience is my students get hands-on learning with real children teaching them, um, just learning how to teach them at a developmentally appropriate level. We get these children prepared for preschool, especially at this age, they're four and five. Um, the social skills, just the learning to be away from, you know, mom and dad for a couple hours, just to get them ready for kindergarten. And, you know, in return, the little ones get a lot of one-on-one -on -one individualized attention. So it's really a benefit for, for both the big and the, and the little children. And here we are taught to, communicate with them and how to get along with them and how to teach them properly. And I think that when I go to college in the fall, I'll be able to use those skills that I learned here in the real life world. I want to be a fourth grade teacher, uh, whether it's here or somewhere else, I really don't care. I just wanna be able to do what I wanna do every day. I'm just really, I'm really excited to continue my career at Kent. Depending on the pathway that they choose after, after high school, some of them are college bound, some want to go right into the job market, and we prepare them for both. So in this program, you can get college credit for taking this program, which will obviously help you if you choose to go and get your bachelor's in education. Early childhood is the pre-K through three that you would get should you go on to college. We also help prepare them for what's called a CDA, it's a Child Development Associate and that will help them if they want to go right into the job market after, after high school. Uh, preschools want to hire people with the CDA. The state is now requiring them, so they will uh, get jobs a lot easier and they will get paid a little bit more money. Out of my five seniors, I have three of them currently working in a body shop, and the demand is really high. Um, I, just in this past month, I've had three um, Three collision shops contact me, you know, knocking down my door, looking for looking for students, say, saying, "Hey, you know, we'll take whatever you have. Um, I, you know, we don't need to know. They don't need to know to the tops right now. We'll train. We'll do on-the-job training with them to get them where they need to be. 
Uh, so there is a high demand for the auto collision industry right now. Uh, so if you're just looking to get a job, man, this is where it's at because they're just pounding down my door looking for recruits. Growing up, me and my stepdad always worked on cars, and I've always wanted to paint cars and more so motorcycles, but they didn't have one for motorcycles here. So I went to cars. So that's why I came into this industry. I'm planning on going to college to be to learn a little bit more about airbrushing and then starting up my own business. If you like working on cars and you want to make them look nice, this is a good uh, industry to get in. I have, you know, I'll even throw some names out there like like King Collision and Gerber, those bigger shops. You know, they're they're knocking on my door just as much as the little mom and pop shops like like uh, BC Automotive out in out in Green, um, Payne's Auto Body in Cortland, uh, and even Ken's Auto Body, you know, over there by 422. So they're all kind of looking at me, uh, you know, expecting me to re with results. So. Um, you know, there's definitely room in this program for, for anybody with willingness to, to get out there and work. Brain Gain is sponsored by Farmers National Bank, Sweeney Chevrolet Buick GMC, the Mahoning Valley Manufacturers Coalition, and Southwoods Health. Thanks for watching the video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit that little bell for notifications. And also make sure to connect with us on Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn. For all of your business news, visit businessjournaldaily.com. For all of your arts and entertainment news, go to afterhoursyoungstown.com.